all five brilliant chess moves played by the magical the magnificent the goat magnus carlson so let's not waste time and enjoy his five brilliancies this move is widely regarded as a move of the year 2023 his opponent is polish number one jan christoph judah in this position magnus plays the only winning move which is the brilliant bishop to g5 now this bishop can be captured with the knight with the queen and even with the pawn but either way you take it black is losing the game in this position if magnus plays the very natural rook to c8 check and wins the rook he will get check made it after queen e1 check king to g2 force queen takes f2 check king to h3 queen to f1 check king to g4 and queen to f5 will be checkmate so after bishop to g5 if you take with the knight now you no longer have queen to e1 checkmate so rook to c8 will win you a rook Similarly, if he takes with the queen after queen takes and pawn takes, you're again going to lose the rook. And if you take with the pawn, you're losing the rook immediately. So if you think that was brilliant, so let's jump to number 4. Here Magnus is just 12 years old and his opponent has played as 6. Now 99% of you people will move the knight here, but will Magnus Carlsen? Queen takes a7. And now black is completely doomed here. If he takes the queen, Magnus has rook takes bishop and after queen to d8 which is a force you will take the queen and in the end you have knight to f7 check to win the material. Even if black plays rook to b8, Magnus will take the rook and in the end of this variation Magnus will be having a 3 pieces for a queen here. So if you think that was brilliant too, so let's jump to number 3. In chess, it is very rare when you play a move which is checkmate turns out to be a brilliant move. Magnus is playing his arch rival Fabiano Caruana in Speed Chess Championship. In this position, Magnus plays a very tricky move, rook to f8 and it looks like it will be a draw as this pawn is not going anywhere. So Fabiano Caruana here plays rook to d1 and here is a checkmate, can you guys find it? Rook to e4, the brilliant checkmate is on the board. It's checkmate as pawn can't take it because it's pinned and black king has literally no square to go into. If you think that was brilliant too, then let's jump to number 2. Here Magnus is under 12 years old and playing his country fellow man John Ludwig Hammer. Here in this position, white has played bishop to e3 so cutting the defense of the knight and preparing rook to e1 to take the knight. And here Magnus Carlsen just played rook takes e4 and hammer played rook to e1 and just completely neglecting the idea of black. Here Magnus plays a move with just force resignation and that move is brilliant queen to h5 check and you are forced to take with the pawn and just rook to h4 is a checkmate. So if you think that was brilliant too then let's see the most brilliant move of Magnus Carlsen. This breathtaking move was played in 2016 in World Championship match between Magnus Carlsen and Sergei Karyakin. Looks like Magnus Carlsen is getting checkmated in many ways but why to worry when you can checkmate yourself. In this position Magnus plays the brilliant queen to h6. Now if you take with the king rook to h8 is a checkmate and if you take with the g pawn rook to f7 is a checkmate. So these were the most brilliant moves of Magnus Carlsen. So do like the video and subscribe to the channel to show love and support. So see you all in the next parts.